Hey guys, I'm Andre. I'm Elton. And this is ATV. And we're ready to watch the second episode of Fire Force. Mm -hmm. Our first episode was really good. We were, got intrigued. So we're going to end up watching the second one and pretty much just find out more about what this story has to tell. Yeah. Because uh, there was so many like things that they pretty much told us the motivations for, every, for like at least the main character, his backstory and stuff. So I'm kind of ready to get past and see the future of what yeah, he has. Plus we were becoming confused for a bit of the first episode. From like one thing, yeah. But we kind of figured it out. Mm -hmm. I thought it was going to be like a thing that was going to be told later on, but that was us being a little misunderstanding of something. Yeah. We figured it out, no problem. So let's get on to this episode and see what it has to offer. Yep. Let go. That'd be pretty scary if that happened, Kate, like every day. New character. Wait. I'm gonna put it down. Oh god, he looks like a. What is this? Looks like Mako's father, but younger than with a blonde hair. What generation is that guy? Is he also three? Well, from his sword. No, maybe he'll. Maybe fire. he. Yeah, and then fire comes out of him. Is that guy Mako? Yeah, I'm pretty sure. Mako. Yeah. I was wondering if I said Mako's father. I wonder if that, that dude trained them. What the? Yo, Akuma. Nande te mei ga koko ni inda yo. Kusto kishiga. Akuma taiji ni kita. Nanda to tamanegi yaro wa omote te ra. What? What? That was a weird cut. Let's take this out. <laughs> It just cuts like that. No, I don't think it is. What? I don't think those are the same girl. No, they're not. I, I noticed that. I thought it was. Yeah, because I thought it was her, but no, it's not. Maybe it is. It's a new person that hasn't shown up still. We're talking about the girl in the intro anyways. Because I feel like we'll probably cut that out so the people aren't going to understand what we're talking about. We thought it was... There's this girl, but... But we thought it was her. <laughs> It's Kaltazar, I think it's an owl. I think that's his name. From uh, Thousands and Castle. This is when he was a baby. Makes sense. Oh. Hmm. She's powerless. So, I don't. She's trying to grab the flame. Yeah. Because of the memory. He doesn't have a sword. So he's a third generation, right? Yeah, I'm just. Yeah. Or is he gonna take that one? Like Conan Boyle? Or yeah, Death he Doyle? is a third generation. Yeah, so he's probably gonna make fire out of it. Siblings? <laughs> He's like, what? Now they're looking at it. <laughs> He's gonna wash, he's gonna spray it out. No! Yeah. Kill him! No! no I knew it! 
Anyone's gonna have <laughs> killed him! And you're just gonna have to kill them! Oh my. Jeez. <laughs> 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 right, like he's gonna kill him. Ah! They do like little like sight gags, which is really funny as I do that. Her name's Maki. <laughs> Jesus, that's intense. Haven't you been there? How long has she been? What? <laughs> Wait, what? Is she Oh, I kind of guessed. Yeah, yeah, I kind of guessed that might have happened. Ten out of ten. Alright, <laughs> 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 call it. That's Crazy. lightning. What the heck? Maybe that's. Same thing. What is this avatar? Plasma. <laughs> Something was flying. <laughs>。<laughs><笑><笑><笑><笑> What? what? Oh, it's like, <laughs> the, like the nose dude, the nose hair guy. Is she, does she make any references to different anime or something? Yeah, I don't know. Something's gonna make him mad. <笑>俺には必要ないね。俺には Full out of armor in there. <laughs> 30 kilos of I wonder if something's gonna make him mad in, uh, mm -hmm. in this episode. Mm -hmm. It's like you are supposed to, it's almost like you are supposed to kind of know these characters already almost. And they're just adding new ones into it. I don't know, it's just weird. Why would having an axe make his abilities? Mm 
Seem more like B gray man, Oh, something's gonna have calf happen. Mm. Can't just end this quickly. Yeah, I knew something was gonna happen because the guy just put some stuff in. It's not just Zoro and voice. He's gonna get angry. Like this guy. What did that say? I don't know. Maybe I think he might have said Joe. Get him in there. Oh, that was an episode. 
Yeah, and also, see, you know, it seems like there's people behind these things now. Well, yeah. I don't know about people behind the combustion. You say you don't want to see them. Like, and then it's the thing of like, was the father actually like, was there actually just something weird happening, or what? Did he actually like fight it? Or, like, well, well, they say it said that uh, it was a quiet, whatever it was called, a quiet scene fire, or something like that. Which so it seems like yeah, it does happen where they just don't do anything really. And it's just the you're just going there to put it out. That's, I wonder if they like if they're ever gonna say because it, it seems like it's not something they're gonna bring up exactly what he said to them. Oh uh, yeah, I think it was he, it was just that he was saying that they're not here to they're not here to fight. They're just here to kill. Well, well he said that uh, what well, we we call it um putting them to rest, but it's actually I think it's just killing. Like, it's just like it's kind of weird that's just like, yeah they it. didn't say it is it weird like it's, it, I think it's just for dramatic they fantasy. usually only do that in the anime when like dramatic pause or like they're gonna show it later it's show it later or when it's censored like when they literally it's a PG-13 yeah. thing where they don't I, I wouldn't see that in this really yeah but uh or you could be like Naruto I'm gonna <laughs> destroy <laughs> you <laughs> Yeah. That was sad. Like the girl like yeah. literally offended her mom and then so it's she was just did it two years, years ago. And then her dad now and then so she's scared it's gonna happen to her and she lost all the family. And they couldn't even tell her that it wouldn't happen to her. They're just saying Sorry. that it, they're just trying to reassure her mm -hmm. that her her parents are wishes and stuff like that. It's mm -hmm. sad. Nothing they can do though, it's like yeah, that's such a weird thing. I feel like just burning. Like, that's the kind of thing. It's like it is. It kind of seems like, like I said, with D. Gray Man with the demon thing, which was a bit different. It made more sense. I feel which this one might make sense just for right now. It's just people randomly mm -hmm. going on fire. But D. Gray Man, it was that the Millennium Earl had to go to someone that wanted that yeah. had like some Wish like. Or like a pressure. wish or like yeah like some being in despair and something like that and he could he can like use that to make them turn into demons and then so them trying to literally kill the de kill them to be like it's kind of the same as this where it's like probably putting them to rest so their souls can go yeah but i'm like and that's the thing so you still had someone to direct your anger at kind of it's like it's this and same with demon slayer it's like, he's the one that's making the demons what's wrong with yeah. and with this it's just like just seemingly like people are randomly just become because you don't know who's doing it or why or, or if there is or it's just maybe there was some experiment that happened and now the world is just causing people to do it all right uh we're gonna get them actually watch the next episode yeah. so if you like this episode don't forget to leave a like comment down below any serious videos you want to watch and don't forget to hit that subscribe button and maybe ring that notification bell so you can catch more of our videos because Honestly, we're not the, like, on track kind of people, mm -hmm. so ringing that bell will actually help a lot to know when we post a video. And that said, see ya!